Way before New Year's, very exciting news at Sister North Syracuse High School. The students are getting ready for their fall production of the play 12 Angry Jurors, and opening night kicks off tomorrow. Maybe it's something you'd like to get tickets for. It'll be inside the high school's auditorium. That's where we find News Channel Line's Ashley Cafaro this morning. There for us at CNS. Good morning, Ashley. Very exciting for these students. Nicole, the countdown is on. Students are thrilled to finally be back on stage again, performing in front of a live audience. And with me, I have two seniors, Mikey, who is a cast member, and then also Legend, who is a crew member. Both of you, thank you so much for joining me this morning. Thanks for getting up so early. I'm sure you had rehearsal last night. So let's get right to it. So, Mikey, what's your role in the play, and how have you been preparing for it? So, my role in the play is we each go by our jury number. So, I'm juror number eight. I'm kind of the character who gets people talking, who changes everyone's opinion from immediately voting not guilty just so everyone can leave, or immediately voting guilty so that everyone can leave, to changing it to uh, people voting not, gu or not guilty so that we can, you know, get this case right. Um, and we've been preparing. We've had uh, rehearsal Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So, just run through our lines, memorizing our lines, and get them up on the stage with our, with our blocking and stuff. Great. That's really exciting. And Legend, I know um, school activities were put on hold last year because of the pandemic. How does it feel to be able to get a crew back together this year and finally put on a live performance? You know, it's really great. We've been waiting for this for what seems like ever. I mean, it's been two years. You know, we have 70% new people, so we're just really excited to get back. You know, we're trying all these new methods and approaches, so we're just really excited to get back on stage. All right, great. Thank you both so much. And they're going to give us a sneak peek right now, so let's see it, guys. Assume, now listen to me, you people, I've seen all kinds of dishonesty in my day, but this little display takes the cake. What dishonesty? Tell them, you come in here with your heart bleeding all over the floor about slum kids and injustice. You've got some soft part of old ladies listening to you. Well, I'm not. I'm getting real sick of you. What's the matter with you people? The kid's guilty. He's got a burn. We're letting him slip through our fingers. Our fingers? Are you his executioner? Of one of them? Perhaps you'd like to pull the switch. For this kid, you'd better like to pull the switch. I'm sorry for you. Don't start with me. What it must feel like to want to pull the switch. Shut up. You're saying shut up. You want to see this boy die because you personally want to. And again, the opening night is tomorrow at 7, and in less than 30 minutes, I will be talking to the director. Live in, at CNS High School, Ashley Cafaro, News Channel 9. Oh, boy. It get, it's getting heated behind Ashley. Testy courtroom. We can't give you too much of a tease, though. Yeah, it is intense. Well, you can get tickets for that.